And then I'm going to transfer this over to Miss Val. Post. All right. We are ready to rock and roll. All right. You start the music. Got different music this morning. Well, good morning, Wanda. Hey, Becky, how are you? <laughs> I'm good. It's good to see you. I haven't seen you in so long. I know. I was. All right, let's get. <laughs> Woo! How do you like this song? Can you hear it? Do that I want now. I feel good. I knew that I would now. <laughs> Feel good. So good. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I guess it doesn't feel so good. <laughs> it's an old CD. I was hoping. I was hoping. We'll have to go with our oldie but goodie. Ooh. Well, we can feel good at least for a minute. Yeah. Uh, well, good morning, everybody. I'm Jackie Green from the Chatham Council on Aging. We're glad you're here. We're having a little technical difficulty with um, streaming to YouTube this morning, as well as our music and temperamental. It must be the rainy day, but we're not going to let it worry us. We're going to keep on a going. Amen. So we're going to go ahead and we'll start with a warm up, then we'll do our stretching. So just march in place. Make sure you're only doing what you can do, what the doctor says you can do. Glad you're all here. Oh, I need to change my view. Enjoy that music a minute. Music is a wonderful thing. On the floor. All right. Let's start with our eight, eight, and eights this morning. So we'll do a eight marches, our eight wide narrow narrows, our eight V-steps, followed by our eight knee dips. Okay, we'll start with the left leg. All right, here we go. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wide, wide, narrow, narrow. Two, you can add arms if you want. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, go into V-step, go forward, forward, back, back, forward, forward, back, back. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Doing our little knee dips, make sure you're sitting back so your knees stay behind toes, slow shoulder rolls. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Left arm back, forward. Two, three, follow with your eyes. Four, that's still tight. Still sitting, six, seven, and eight. Arms back, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Hands on the sides. Roll up to cat. Dip down to cow. Keep going a little farther, a little farther each time. Three, four, five. Really tuck that belly in when you go up. Seven. Oh, that feels better. And eight. Go inside to side. Bring left, right shoulder forward. Go back, then go to the other side. Hips and knees remain forward. Want to make sure your hips and your knees are staying forward. It's just your shoulders are going and your spine. Five, six, seven, and eight. Back to a march. Do the same thing on the left on the right leg. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wide, wide, and arrow. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, and eight. Go into V-step. 
Forward, forward, back, back. Two, three. Four. Four. <laughs> five. Six. Is it Hyde? Seven. Yeah. Yeah. That's eight. Lily Depp. Two. Uh, three. Four. Five. Slow for all. Six. Seven. And eight. Right arm back and forward. Really try to open up that shoulder. Three. A little more, a little more time. Five. Belly's tight and back. Seven and eight. Both arms back. Really stretch out that chest. Three. Four. You're still make, doing little knee. As you do this, you're still warming up the knees. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. Hands back on the thighs. You're rolling back up to cat. You're dipping down to cow. Two. And down. Three. And down. Four. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. Back up to a march. All right, go ahead and do a side tap. Get right, shoulder, sorry. Shoulders. Sorry. Oops. I was showing you about going to the next step. <laughs> Four. Make sure the hips and the knees remain forward and it's just fine. Let's turn. Six. Seven. See, music does that to me. Eight, <laughs> nine, and ten. Back march. I can't dance well, but I love it. <laughs> okay, side tap. All right, let's do a, let's do arm swings. And if you can, do little knee dips as we do this. That way, we're continuing to strain our thighs and our glutes. We all need that. All right, let's do A's and then we'll do hamstring curls with the arms. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hamstring curl. Three, four, five, six, seven. Now pull back with the arms. Still doing three, hamstring curls three, with the legs. Four, four, five, oh, four, six, five, seven, six, seven eight. eight. Pull up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Pull back again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Pull down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Back again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, everything four. One, two, three, four, back. One, two, three, four, down. One, two, three, four, pull back. One, two, three, four, up, everything, boo. Two, 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 two. okay, let's Swing those hips, loosen up those hips after all that side, sideward movement. I hope that's water, Ed, and not coffee. <laughs> Let's do some happy hands as we do our hips, just because we can. Open it with those hands, too. Okay, wrist circles. Go the other way. All right, let's do some, oh, let me go up here a little bit. Let me turn my screen down just a little bit. All right. Heel digs. Alternating arm pushes. We'll do it at different levels. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, shoulder height. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, diagonal, up one, two, three, four, real stretch, six, seven, overhead, one, two, three, four, make sure you're counting, six, six seven, eight, diagonally up again, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, shoulder height, three, four, five, six, seven, diagonally down, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, all the way to your side, three, four, five, six, everything four, here we go, ready, one, two, three, four, shoulder, one, two, three, four, diagonally up, one, two, three, overhead, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, diagonally down, one, two, everything two, here we go, ready? One, two, 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 and one, back to a march. All right, <clears throat> so the reason we do those, those decreasing number of reps as we go and down is we're trying to get that brain to fire. We want it to know where it's going. Go ahead and get a drink. We'll follow Al's lead since she's appeared on me. All right. We ready for some jump rope? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This gets us our little bit of our hit training in. Three, four, a little bigger circle. Five, six, seven, bigger yet. One, two, three, four, five, six. One more set of big ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, smaller. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, here we go. Fast if you want. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Backwards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Bigger. One. Two, make sure you're only doing what you can do. If you've got to stop a minute, don't stop completely. Go ahead, go ahead a little bigger. One, two, just march in place. Four, five, six, seven. Another sequence. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Smaller. One, two, three, four, five, six. Fast if you want, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, crisscross. One, two, three, four, five. Make sure you count six, seven, bigger. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, bigger yet. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, bigger, say another set of big ones. Two, three, four, five. Keep marching in place at seven, eight, smaller. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here we go, fast if you want, ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, <clears throat> seven, and eight. Nice big deep breath. Exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. Let's roll those shoulders back. <clears throat> Left arm out, bring it across, pull it in. Keep the feet moving. Open and close the hand as we're stretching the shoulder as well. All right, relax that arm down. Bring it up to the middle of your back. Bring the hand up to the elbow, pull it down and back. Oh, this feels wonderful. I have to admit, I didn't exercise last week. I don't know about you. Nope. Wasn't like 
I didn't do anything. I just, I didn't do this. Unwind. There were a few days that I did stretch, right arm out, bring it across, pull the arm in, open and close the hand. You're concentrating on stretching the shoulder, but you're working the hand as well. Okay, relax the arm down, bring it up to the middle of the back, hand on the elbow, pull it down. <clears throat> Unwind, all right, interlock your fingers, turn your hands inside out, feel the stretch in your hands, inhale and bring hands up. Place your feet, stretch your sides. Make sure the belly's tight, tailbone's tucked. Come up center, go to the other side. Oh, it feels good, feel the stretch in the hands, the arms, the side, come up center, let's go one more time to each side. Try to keep everything in the same plane so your body is all in the same plane, up center and to the other side. All right, unwind the hands, go up to goal post. We're gonna pull the elbows back, march again if you want. Exhale and your hands together, stretch out the middle of the back. Inhale, stretch out the chest. Exhale, stretch out the back. Inhale. Squeeze those shoulder blades together as close as you can get them and exhale bring them together. Each time try to go back a little farther and a little farther. More time both ways. Jungle boge. Uh, let's do some little kicks here. And Let's do some ab work as we're standing today. So as we do this, let's do our, let's do so, a few knee lifts and curl and tighten those belts. You can bring opposite knee to the opposite elbow. You can do that sitting as well if you want to. Tighten that belly. All right, let's do some mountain climbers. Reach up high. Another eight, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's go back to the curls. Two, three, four, tighten that belly. Six, seven, eight, again, one, two, three, four, five, six. One more set of mountain climbers. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right, let's, I'm going to sit down to stretch my legs out toward the front of the chair. Left leg out. Hands folded on my thigh. First thing I'm going to do is pull that toe back. Ooh, doggy. Sit nice and tall, tuck that tailbone under, then hinge forward, chest toward the thighs. Oh, man. Keep breathing. Reach down with that left arm, see how close you're getting to that toe want. Try to get the chest close to the thigh if you can. Breathe. Go ahead and press on that right thigh and come on back up. Switch to the other leg. Pull the toe back. Just concentrate on the calf and the back of the ankle at the point. Feel the bottom of the foot. Feel it stretching. When you're ready, hinge at the hips. Bring the chest to the thighs. Ooh, doggy. Reach down with that. Right hand if you want to see how close you're getting. Come on back up, press on that left leg, come on back up. We're turned to the side, we're gonna stretch out our quadricep and our hip flexor. Turn to the right, left hip is off the chair. Let that leg come down and back. Tuck that tailbone under so you get a hip flexor stretch. 
and you can either pull the toe up if you want or you can just stretch it out this way it depends on how you feel this morning where you where you're feeling the stretch breathe Go ahead and release and turn to the other side. Again, make sure that the hip is off the chair. Bring in the leg back, tailbone is tucked under. You want to feel the stretch in the hip flexor. Oh, I feel that in the front of that thigh. Breathe. Make sure the tummy's tucked in, the tailbone's tucked. And let's go ahead and release. All right, let's legs apart. Hands or elbows inside the knees. Stretch out those inner thighs. Breathe deeply. Come on back up. Let's bring the legs back in. Left hand on the outside of the right knee, right hand on the back of the chair, twist to the right. Only if your doctor says that you can. If you have severe osteoporosis, you don't do this. See how far around you can get your eyeballs, your chin. Pretend you're all release and let's go to the other side. Oh, that feels good. Make sure you're breathing. All right, let's go ahead and get a gym. We're going to use the weights. keep our car up as we do our weights today so we're just gonna go to we're gonna watch our how how quick we do our reps so go ahead and make sure you rest your shoulders down we're gonna start with our elbows and to our side we'll do our bicep curls okay both at the same time ready here we go ready one two three four five this is with wrist straight Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go to twelve. Eleven, twelve. Rest your arms, roll your shoulders. Now, if you only want to do eight reps, that's fine. Do what you can do. You want to feel your muscles fatigue, but you don't want to exhaust yourself. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and we'll place our legs. We'll put our hands up next to our shoulders. The belly's tight, the tailbone's tucked. One arm at a time directly overhead. One, two, three, four, five. If your weight's not enough, pretend that you're pushing up the ceiling. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Again, one. Two, upper body remains stationary except for the arms. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Rest the arms, roll the shoulders. All right, let's do forward, let's do um, front raises. So one arm at a time, you're going to start with your palms facing backwards, one arm at a time directly in front of your nose. The arm stays straight the whole time, but it's coming up in front of your nose, alternating arms. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and eleven, 
another set of 12. Here we go. One, that way we get 12 on each arm. Two, three, four. Belly's tight, tailbone's tucked. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. Rest the arms, roll the shoulders. Keep the feet moving. All right. The next one are for Patty. We're going to do our picture pours. <laughs> okay. So we're going to take and we're going to bring our arms up. Palms are facing down. Pour them, tip them back up, bring them down. So lift, pour, lift, down. I say lift, pour, turn right side up and down. Four, belly's tight, tailbone's tucked. Five, six, seven, eight, here we go, 12, nine, is that pushing it today? 10, if you need to stop, stop. 11, oh, I feel these today. One more. 12. 12. <laughs> Rest it all. Who took last week off? <laughs> all right. Let's go back and let's do another set of our arm curls. This time we're going to do it with our, our hands cocked into a J. So your wrist into a J. Okay. Leave the J as you do the whole thing. Okay. So now you bend and down. Two. Keep the rock the whole time. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, Woo. Nine. nine, and ten. Okay, rest the arms, roll the shoulders. All right, anchor the arms into your side. We're going to to our shoulder rotators. Okay, rotate the hands out, elbows stay in, and bring them back in together. The waist is just resting on your hands. Two and in three make sure the belly's tight tailbone's tucked four five six seven eight nine one more and ten Ooh, doggy. Rest the arms, roll the shoulders. All right, we're going to sit. We're going to our legs. Actually, let's do our forearms first. Give them one more, one more workout. Okay, so you're, you're sitting and your, your hands are resting on your forearms from the elbows to the wrist. You're going to curl your wrists up and down. Two. I lost Wanda. Three. I'm still here. Four. Awesome. Here you are. <laughs> Six, you thought you could hide from me. <laughs> Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one. Ten. All right. Rotate your arm, hands upside down or whatever. Now the inside of your forearms are against your thighs. Lift, lift your wrists up backwards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Last one, ten. All right. Now we're going to sit <clears throat> up toward the edge of our chair. So just our cheeks are on the chair. Let's bring our left leg out in front. Okay. You're going to rest your weight on your, on your leg if you want to. You don't have to use the weights if you don't want to. 
but if you're doing this, your back is staying straight. We're not all curled up. We're still tall and proud, okay? And then you're gonna tighten the belly. You're gonna tuck the tailbone, okay? Then raise the leg and lower <clears throat> without, without jerking to three. There's no momentum involved. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, eight nine, nine, last one, ten. ten. Shake that leg out. Let's switch to the other side. Again, you're tall and proud. Belly's tight, tailbone tucked. Okay, the toe is neutral, meaning your toe is not pointed out or in. Okay, and raise and lower. Two, make sure your shoulders are relaxed. Three, the legs doing all the work. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! Rest that leg, shake it out. Let's go back to the first leg. We're going to take and put the weight on the leg again. This time the toe is going to be pointed out. We work the inner muscles of the leg. Again, tall and proud, belly tight, tailbone tucked. This time you're going to pretend that there's a string attached inside ankle bone, and that's what's pulling your leg up and down, okay? So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, woo, nine, one more, ten. Turn the leg inside. Turn the toe in. The, the string is next to the outside bone of your ankle. Again, tall and proud, belly tight, tailbone tucked, and raise and lower. Two, three. You're tall and proud. Four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, last one, ten. Woo, shake that leg out. Switch to the other side, other leg. Leg is pointed out. Again, we're working the inside muscle. The string is attached to the inside ankle bone. Here we go. One, two, three. Four, five, belly's tight, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Turn the leg in, toe is in, lift in with the outside ankle bone. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, woo, nine, and last one, ten. Shake those legs out. All right. Let's hold the weights crisscross on our chest, okay? And we're going to do our, we're going to do some ab work. The first thing is you tighten your abs, you tuck your tailbone under, okay? We're gonna lean back and then pull yourself back up using those abdominal muscles. One. Two. Make sure you're counting. Three. You're exhaling on the way up when you're exerting. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Make sure that tailbone's tucked. If you're feeling this in your lower back, tuck your tailbone more. Nine. Last one. Ten. Rest your waist. You can put your hands on the back of the chair and lean forward and relax that, those abdominal muscles. Relax the chest. Again, when you're doing that, one thing you want to be careful of, too, is make sure your neck is relaxed. Try not to tense your neck when you do that, okay? Isn't this music fun? All right. <laughs> let's take and let's hold. You can hold your weights crisscross if you want. We're going to do some more work on the obliques. So we're going to bring our left shoulder to our right knee. Okay. 
I'm going to do it by coming forward and lifting the knee. You can leave the knee down and just go forward if you want. Two. Three. To the tailbones, tuck. Four. Five. Think about all those muscles. Seven. Eight. From the pubic bone all the way up to the rib cage. Ten. Let's do another ten. One. Two. Three. Really crunch. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one. Ten. Very good. Woo. Let's take. Let's put the weights down. Carefully make sure you're leaning your forearm on your leg as you get rid of your weights. All right. Let's see how we doing time wise. All right. Let's let's get a drink. And I got to pick up. I've been looking at this staple on my floor for whole time. Figured it was time to pick it up. All right. Got to do our brain dance. You can do it sitting or you can do it standing. It's up to you. Okay. So remember with brain dance, we do each leg four times, each arm four times. And we do heel to the front, then toe out to the side. Okay. I think. Oh, Wanda, you haven't done this with us. So let me, um, let me walk you through it a little bit. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we'll start with heel, heel, toe to the front. We go heel, toe, three, four, other foot. Heel, toe, heel, toe, three, four. Then we touch toe out to the side for four times. Three, four, other leg. One, two, three, four. Then we do can. Knee, touch, kick. She's a line dancer. Knee, touch, kick. So I know she'll pick this up quick. Knee, touch, <laughs> knee, touch, kick. That's the legs. Okay. Then with the arms, we do the same kind of motion with the arms, but we're going to punch out to the front for four with each arm. Three, four, other arm. One, two, three, four, out to the side for four. Two, three, four, right arm. One, two, three, four. Then we do a pull, cross. Two, three, four, same thing, but now we go overhead. One, two, three, and four. Then we do our neck and we look to the left and center. Left. We do this half speed, so always gentle with our neck. Three, four, then we go to the right. Right, center, right, center, three, four, then we look down. Chin down and center. Down, center, three, four, then we look up and center. Up, center, up, center, three, four, then we do a head tilt. Shoulders are relaxed through all this neck. Tilt, center, tilt, center, three, four, then right center, right, center, right, center, three, Four. Now the work is you got to try to remember what we're doing. So you want to be a half step ahead in your brain of what you're doing next. We're going to start with our feet. We go from to arms to head. Okay. We go. You're not going to get it perfect. Don't worry about it. We're just working on it. Okay. So I'll count down. Here we go. Ready? Four, three, two, one. Heel, toe, heel, toe, three. Four, heel, toe, heel, toe, three, going out to the side. Two, three, four, other side. One, two, three, can, can, knee, touch, kick, knee, touch, kick, knee, touch, kick, knee. Then we go to arms, punch. One, two, three, four, other arm. One, two, three. Out to the side, one, two, three, 
four, other side, one, two, three, we're going to pull, so pull back, cross, two, three, four, same thing overhead, one, two, three, four, now look to the left, left, center, three, four, right, center, right, center, right, center, three, four, look down, down, center, down, center, three, four, look up, up, center, up, center, three, four, tilt, tilt left, center, left, center, three, four, right, center, right, center, right, center, three, four. Okay, march in place. So the last thing we're gonna do is we're gonna do it, what I was doing before, and we're gonna actually put both arms into everything. So when we go forward, we're pulling our arm, we're pulling our left arm back as our right goes forward, and etc. When we go to the side, you're pulling both arms. Okay, so let's see if we can do that as well. Trying to challenge that brain, get that muscle brain connection going. We count us down again. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. One, two. Three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, side, one, two, three, four, can, can, knee, touch, kick, knee, touch, kick, three, four, arms, here we go, one, two, three, four, other side, one, two, three, Four to the side. One, two, three, four. Other side. One, two, three, four. Cross. One, two, three, four. Overhead. One, two, three, four. Head. Left. Center. Left. Get your keep your arms moving. Three, four. Other side. One, two. Three, four, look down, down, center, down, center, three, four, look up, up, center, up, center, three, four, tilt, one, two, three, four, other side, one, two, woo. Three, I feel so much more flexible. Four, very good. Roll the shoulders. All right, I gotta get one more drink. Let's get one drink. <laughs> oh, that's, I don't have a slow one out here. All right, well, we aren't gonna have a slow one then. We're gonna work out with music for this part portion. All right, so let's go ahead. We're going to start our we're going to start our stretching. I'm going to keep walking in place. I don't want my heart rate to drop. I want it to come down slowly, so I'm just slowing down the pace of walking. So let's go ahead and bring our left arm out. We're going to cross our body. Let's pull it in this way this time. Ooh man, arm over. I always like doing it this way at the end because it gives me a little better stretch. Now, as you do this, let's concentrate on doing three very deep breaths in each position, okay? Exhale completely. Okay, relax. The arm down, bring one arm up and over to the middle of your back, the other one up from the bottom, and again, three complete breaths here. Unwind, bring the left arm, right arm out, bring it across, the left arm up and over, pull it in. Three complete breaths here. I like that, Patty. Wiggle those fingers. We 
relax arm down bring the arm up and over to the middle of the back other one up to the bottom three complete breaths see how much mo how much closer you can get your hands how far you can overlap fingers if you can get that far feel the stretch in front of the lower arm Okay, unwind. Let's do a stop sign stretch. Stop sign with the left hand. Pull back those fingers with the right. Again, three complete breaths. Pay attention to all the sensations in that entire arm. Your shoulders relaxed. Switch to the other hand. Again, feel all the sensations from the fingertips all the way up to the armpit. Very good. Relax the arms down, roll those shoulders back. Nice big circles. Now let's work the back. Let's go ahead and go back into cat-cow. So bring your legs apart, hands on your, your thighs. Roll up to cat. See how high you can get your back, how arched you can get it from all the way from the tailbone to the shoulders. Exhale and go down into cow. Dip down as far as you can. Stick that butt up. Stick the head up. Go back, back into cat. Exhale out. Make sure you're exhaling. Pull that belt up. Arch everything you can arch. <laughs> and go back into cow. All right. Now let's go ahead and start flat. Bring, a, bring the left shoulder forward, the right one back, and fold in the middle like a taco as much as you can, but keep your knees and your hips facing forward. So your knees and your hips don't move, it's just your spine moves. Switch to the other side. As much mobility in your spine as you can get, but never to the point of pain. All right, go back to the first side. Imagine your body is like an accordion and it's squishing in the middle, it's coming up on both sides. Our bodies are such miraculous things, we don't really realize just how amazing they are until you get pain and then you focus on the pain and not what the body can do. Let's go ahead and have a seat. We're going to stretch out the legs. Sit forward on the chair. Bring the left leg out. First thing to do is sit tall and proud. Tuck the belly. Tuck the tailbone. Pull that toe back as far as you can. Really feel that stretch in that calf. Today I feel it in the calf all the way up to the, into the hamstring that tells me I'm really tight. Okay, go ahead and hinge at the hips, bring the chest toward the thigh. You may need to relax the thigh a little bit to stretch the hamstring. Make sure your toe is neutral. I look down and my toe is pointed out. That's why I remind you, I cue you because I see it in my own body much of the time. Imagine that somebody, as you're leaning forward, breathing deeply, but make, imagine that somebody's still pulling on your head and making your spine it really, really tall. Again, nice, nice deep breaths here. This is a great time to stretch nice and warm to get more elongation of those muscle fibers. Let's go ahead and press on that right thigh and come on up and let's switch to the other side. Okay, start with the toe back. It's straightening your, your spine. You're tucking your belly. You're tucking your tailbone. You're still pulling that toe back towards your nose. Feel that stretch up the back of that leg. When we get down into the stretch, let's make sure we're doing three nice, big, deep breaths. As we hinge forward, bringing the chest to the thigh, three nice, big, deep breaths as we're down there. Reach down as far as you can. Again, your spine is nice and tall.
complete exhales as you do this. And then push on that left thigh and come on back up. Let's go ahead and bring the legs apart again. Let's stretch the inner thighs. Most people know how to breathe deeply in, but most people don't breathe completely out and you don't exhale completely all that breath. So that's something to really focus on. Press those legs out. Nice, big, deep breaths here. This is also where you can stretch your wrist a little bit more by putting your hands in prayer hands, trying to be straight from elbow to elbow. But again, your, your neck is relaxed, your shoulders are relaxed. And come on back up. Let's go ahead and place our left, right under our left, our right knee. Let's bring our left leg up. Sit tall and proud. Oh, that feels lovely. All right. Press that knee down if you can, using your forearm by putting your hand between your shin and your thigh. Nice big deep breaths here as well. Hinge at the hips, bring your chest towards your thigh, a little deeper stretch here. Take a couple breaths here. You can curl your toes if you want and reach them, lift them and curl them and lift them. Kind of get a little bit of a dynamic stretch going. Release, come on back up, switch to the other leg. Make sure the heel is under the knee. Tall and proud, belly tight, tailbone tucked. Nice big deep breaths. Feel what your body's feeling if something hurts. Give it a break, but if the stretch feels good, hold the stretch. We have to learn to identify the feelings in our body because sometimes when a body part hurts, it's because a muscle is tight. So if you can hold the stretch and just let it relax, sometimes that gives you a really good break. Hinge at the hips, bring the chest to the thighs. But if it really hurts, if it's painful, then you need to stop and give it a break. Again, you can curl your toes and lift your toes while you're here. So you're working your toes as well as stretching your hips. All right, come on back up and sit back. We're gonna finish our breathing here. And as you sit in your chair and just relax, pay attention to your posture and just let your, make sure your shoulders are over your hips. Just breathe naturally, let your shoulders relax. Imagine your earlobes are just relaxed, like somebody just massaged them. Feel the massage going up around the top of your ear to your temple. Little rounded motions around your temple, just relaxing your scalp over your eyebrows to the middle of your eyebrows where we tend to hold a lot of stress. Let the jaw relax. Let the tongue relax behind the lower teeth. Let your cheeks relax. And notice how relaxed your entire body is. Your upper body feels loose. Just let that same feeling spread through your chest, through your abdomen, through your hips, through your thighs. Don't just sink into the chair your knees, calves, and your feet all the way down to your toes. 
You go back and pay attention to how your elbows are hanging down next to your thighs. Your forearms rest on your thighs and just keep everything supported. Let your fingers relax into your thighs. Feel the warmth of your hands on your thighs and the warmth of your thighs on your palm of your hand. And just breathe. On the next exhale, go ahead and make your full exhale. Breathe out all of the, uh, all of the air you have in your lungs. Then inhale deeply. And exhale one more time completely. This time when you, you inhale, bring your arms up. Exhale and bring your arms completely down. Inhale, bring your hands up together overhead. Look at your hands coming together, palm to palm, finger to fingertip. Exhale and bring them down center in front of your face. Inhale, raise a thought or a prayer as you raise your hands up. And exhale down. Inhale, wrap your arms around in a hug. Give yourself a squeeze. Remind yourself safe and you're healthy. Unwind. Inhale again. Wrap your arms the other way. Remind yourself you're loved, you're valued, you're full of purpose. And relax. Excellent job, everybody. Thank you. Nicely done. Make sure you drink a lot of water today. Okay. And I hope to see everybody again on Thursday. Friday. 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 If not Thursday. Thursday and Friday. <laughs> or Thursday and Friday. That's right. Bye-bye. Oh. Right. I'll stop the recording. Bye. Uh, Jackie? Yes, please. Thank you. Did you, yes, have a, did you have a class yesterday? Was there a class? I did. I tried to There join. was an arthritis class yesterday. Okay, I will send you, okay, so what we're doing on that is I am not recording that, to, we're not putting that on the website, but if I know that there's somebody who's part of us that has not been able to participate in it, I can send.